Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create this nice luma fade transition. So we're essentially going to be transitioning from one to the other looking kind of like this right here. It's a fun transition that you can sort of string together and make it so that it feels like everything is blending together. Real simple effect. Let's get started on this. So first things first, I'm going to go ahead and delete these and then import some footage. I'm going to, I grab this footage from Envato Elements, which is a great subscription based service where you pay a monthly fee and you get a near unlimited amount of stock footage. Check out the link in the description below. So what we want to do is we want to take our bottom footage, the one that we're starting with and put it right here. And then we want to take this top footage right here and we want to put them over one another. We then want to go into our effects and look for an effect called Luma Key under video effects keying Luma Key. We're going to drag that onto the top footage. Now we want to start the top footage off one at 100, 100. That is going to make it so that it is completely see-through to the bottom. You should be able to scroll and it should look like nothing happened. We then want to go to the very first scene or the very first frame right here where the two are shared. We want to turn on the threshold and cutoff as toggled animations. And then we want to move forward about half a second. So I'm using the shift key while I click these to go ahead five. About 15, that should be half a second, maybe a little longer. Let's go 25 frames. We're then going to transition this down to zero, zero. And what that's going to do is it's going to do the transition that we want, the Luma transition. Now, that's a little on the slow side, so we can speed that up depending on what you want. Like I said, if it's a faster paced, then you want this to be faster paced as well. If it's a slow transition, like each one of these clips are, let's say, 10 or 20 seconds, then you want a slower transition. But that is how you do it. It's a very, very simple effect, and it's a very quick effect to make something look more uh, stylistic. Thanks everyone for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, throw them in the comment section below on our website, adobemasters.net. If you like some videos similar to this one, go ahead and subscribe button. Until next time, everyone, see ya.